Speaker cables are among the most important cables in any stereo setup. They can make the biggest difference in sound, whether positive or negative. It can impact various aspects of sound quality, such as tonality, bass tightness, detail retrieval, transient response, dynamics, and more. In this video, we will take a closer look at speaker cables made by a Polish company, Melodica. The model I have with me today is their Brown Sugar series BSSC3300. Their product naming can be a little confusing, so to make it easier, BSSC means that it's made for single wiring, instead of bi-wiring or bi-amping, as they also make cables suited for that. The 33 is referring to the conductor diameter, in this case 3.3 mm square. The last two numbers mean the length. I have this cable seen to and a half meter length, as it was perfect for my previous speaker placement. I stand by the rule you should get as short speaker cables as you can to minimize the sound degradation. All of the cables in the Brown Sugar series are available in a light brown and white color combination. It looks very pleasing in person and can aesthetically complement a neutral colored setup. It can also fit systems that have silver electronics, which are very common, and also systems with wooden elements because of the light brown color. My system is a combination of both actually, meaning speakers with wooden finish and mostly silver electronics. I have to say, I love the way it looks and I love their naming scheme, as it quite literally looks like brown sugar. The only visual complaint that I have is the connector splitting jacket. It looks quite loose and is too thick for this specific cable thickness. On the good side, Melodica offers higher diameter versions of this product, which I would assume makes a better fit with the jacket. Inside this cable, there are some interesting technologies that Melodica either developed or implemented. First of all, it's a Leeds cable so every single conductor is separately insulated. This is a scientifically proven way to greatly reduce the skin effect, which is especially prominent in solid core wires. Going to stranded wire of course helps, but the electrons can still jump from one strand to the other, which leads to the loss of micro-level information buried in the recording. With the Leeds cable it's a non-issue, as it isolates every single strand from each other. To reduce the skin effect even more and divide the frequencies a little, the multi-gauge technology was implemented here. It's something I found quite interesting, as it simply means that they put three different thicknesses of internal wires, so this way the bass, mids and high frequencies are going through different strands and thus interfering with each other less. This is so simple, yet brilliant in its simplicity. To minimize the EMI and other forms of interference, Without compromising the sound quality, they twisted two conductors to create a dual wire braid, instead of shielding the cable. For the isolation, they didn't chip out at all, as it has a tremendous effect on the cable's performance. The conductors have triple dielectric insulation made of LPDE, which is a low density material, superior to a lot of higher density insulators. This cable has been developed with a lot of work and science. But how does it affect the sound of my system? Surprisingly, it makes for a bit calmer and less dynamic experience. But I believe that higher gauge models of this series would improve upon that. In addition, the sound is less harsh. It's a clean, rather neutral sounding cable that doesn't overemphasize the treble region, but seems to push it slightly forward, but ever so slightly, which brings out a lot of details. The soundstage is quite spacious, not the biggest I've ever heard, but it's wide and deep enough. However, it doesn't seem to get diffused or stretched out, as it doesn't make the imaging any less precise. It's often difficult to achieve the sense of depth in a stereo setup, due to factors such as speakers themselves, electronics, or most importantly, the speaker placement. While no cable can magically turn a terrible setup into a perfect one, this one can slightly improve the technical performance of well-established systems and provide a more realistic experience, getting a step closer to how things sound in real life, but with less listening fatigue, especially during long listening sessions. 